Hello, welcome to video number four. I'm John Blicky, professional web designer, and um, this video is due to the t the very strict ten minute um, time limit on videos on YouTube. Is just downloading Firefox, uh, not even customizing. Just downloading, installing, and getting it to work. Um, and I'm just not having a lot of fun with this video because this is like the tenth remake, and I don't edit videos, so. We're going to get straight to it. Um, I have Internet Explorer 7 here running. We're going to go back to Google and just type in Firefox, F-I-R-E-F-O-X. Go to Firefox.com or Mozilla.com, same thing. You click there and uh, in the corner here, you're going to have download Firefox free. It's 100% free using it, download it, anything, all free. Okay, so we're going to click here. And they screwed up the page. They got all this other stuff on here. It's not working on my computer because Inner Explorer is goofy, screwed up, and refuses to work for me because I'm recording the video. And if I wasn't recording the video, it would work fine. So uh, we're gonna just skip, skip ahead down here to the bottom here, um, where uh, there's this link that just directly links to it. I'm gonna right-click on it, save the target as, and we're gonna save this to the desktop. I already have it and it's just going to go ahead and download the file here. I've got broadband and it's going a little pretty slow for broadband especially for European types who have 100 megabit in Denmark I hear and we get um, 5, 6 kilobyte download. Wonderful, right? Alright, so it finished. Uh, even more fun for those on dial-up. So um, we're going to install Firefox. We're going to go ahead and uh, i got to keep this video over here to make sure everything's running smooth. We're going to click Run. It's going to do that. It's going to come up. And then we're going to click Next uh, because the, i got to be quick with this video. Um, just trust me on the options. There are a lot of reasons and I'm just not going to go over them. Except don't blindly accept all uh, license agreements to all software, but Firefox is safe. It's public stuff. Click Next. Uh, always do custom installs on all software. The only software I've ever done I didn't need to do custom install is Tweak UI. And you don't get options for that anyway. You click Next. Uncheck DOM Inspector. You don't need that. Trust me, you don't need that. Uh, keep a check on quality feedback agent. Click next. Uh, I highly recommend putting 2.0 at the end of your Firefox path because you'll, you're, if you're going to seriously follow this, you're going to want to test multiple versions. And why I install one version of Firefox to a folder without a version number. Um, so if you're installing Firefox 2, put 2.0 at the end of the uh, the folder name or three at the end of the folder name, whatever version you're installing, because you might be watching this in like 20 years. Who knows what versions are going to be out there. So I already have this installed, it's just going to override it. We're going to have all the all that stuff checked on, and go ahead and just click on the next button. That's going to install on my computer, and we're going to launch it. Um, here we go. So anyway, um, i got something up here that's... Uh, a little bit different than the default. I'm just going to skip that and just profiles and all that. Here's Firefox by default and um, this is what you're going to see by default. Get the uh, cam out of there and um, that's that because customizing it and installing all these nifty things that's going to take way too much time to do that. In the same video uh, I was running on 12 minutes and now, without having to show you how to customize it until video number five, I think, um, at least you know where to get it if you have no clue. And um, hopefully you'll have a smooth experience trying to get it on your computer. And if you don't know, just find someone who's tech savvy and say, like, oh yeah, inter um, Firefox, great. And if they like Internet Explorer better than Firefox, and they obviously, they, they're not well informed. And you'll be well informed, trust me. So um, this is all to prep you 
assuming that you don't only have Firefox and Web Developer Toolbar and all this other wonderful stuff, to um, very easily um, write code and validate it. And we'll go over all that in the next few videos. But again, 10-minute time limit. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.